All right, welcome back here to Live Now from Fox. I'm Giacomo Luca. Thanks for joining us as we come back here at 742 now on the East Coast, 442 over on the West Coast. Uh, we're learning in this developing story this morning that the Biden administration's waiving dozens of federal laws to build a border wall in South Texas. It's the first time the administration's used this type of executive power. Fox News' Gary Baumgarten has more on this. It's a rare move for the Biden administration, the White House waiving 26 federal laws that will allow for border wall construction in South Texas. The Department of Homeland Security announcing on Wednesday that Starr County is seeing a surge of migrants across the border illegally. This fiscal year alone, 245,000 people illegally crossed through the region according to government data. In a statement, Secretary of Homeland Security Alejandro Mayorkas said, quote, there is presently an acute and immediate need to construct physical barriers and roads in the vicinity of the border of the United States. The president has done more to secure the border and to deal with this issue. All of this comes as illegal entries remain high across the entire southern border. Customs and border protection data shows more than 2.8 million migrant encounters occurred this fiscal year. We take a look at what's happening at our southern border. It is an absolute disaster down there. Extending the border wall contradicts President Biden's statements in 2020 when he promised that, quote, not another foot of wall would be built under him. Those on a local level are also struggling to deal with the influx of asylum seekers. New York City's Mayor Eric Adams taking the journey to Latin America this week as he plans to discourage those seeking shelter from coming to New York. Basically, uh, it has given the false promise of what life is like of being a migrant and asylum seeker. Gary Baumgarten, Fox News. All right, taking a live look out in New York City 